it's Jules and Saad and welcome back to another vlogmas video so today we are going to be answering all of your questions we're not avoiding them we're gonna be completely open and mm. honest that's what we like to do on this channel and I feel like we haven't had like a sit down Q&A of us in a while yeah we've interrogated Antonio we've interrogated his girlfriend but now it's time for you guys to interrogate us <laughs> that's so true. before we go any further with this video we are giving away a hundred dollar gift card it's a master card so we're giving like, away can, multiple you can spin it on whatever you want if you want a chance to win all you have to do is subscribe to this channel turn on the notifications and comment below your instagram or your twitter so we can get a hold of you if you do yeah. win with that being said are you ready yes for these questions i haven't nervous. even looked at them yet haven't looked i have not even looked at them yet if you guys don't follow us follow us on instagram that's where i told you guys to ask all of these what is one thing you would change about each other what would i change about you yeah maybe you i would change your routine of waking up if i could out of everything if i could what what do you want me to change about you i mean i would like you to not feel anxiety i guess thank like you. For you that would be better but, but like but i can't change you having anxiety okay but you want me to wake up early yes okay that that I mean, can get changed i want to change your pressure of me waking up oh today was the first day and i don't know how long saw let me sleep in Boom. as long as Boom. i needed i've been letting you sleep in a lot later and i've been letting you and it's not like i i like hold you hostage or anything no you're like, like wake up or wake up. i've been letting wake you nap up. and i've been letting you nap i've and needed I've been letting to you sleep. listen with vlogmas i have been so Exhausted. But have I been letting you? It's not like I don't I let mean, you. I you should. Like, I'm about to It's fall not like over. I'm like, don't you need to stay. It's not like that. Okay, that's what we would change. Huh? How old were you when you and Saad met? I was 18, which is crazy because I'm 24 now. Was I now. 18 or 19? You don't remember? No. You were probably 19 because... We started... Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You were definitely I 19, 19 because I turned 19. And when we started talking was February. Yeah. And I just turned 19 then. Yeah. Dang. Ew. And literally next month I'm going to be 25. That's crazy. Do I look like I'm 25? No. Do I look like... I don't look like I'm That's about to be 25. That's a good thing. Guys, how old do I look? Like, comment below how old I look. Comment below how old both of us look. I think you look I a mean, lot... I mean, older You with look makeup. more you mature than me. Younger. I look like... I look like a Disney star. You know what I mean? Disney, yeah. hit me up. Okay, people want an update on Piglet. Um, she's doing a lot better. Yes. She's been taking her medicine. She's been hydrated. You know, she's been a lot more playful and stuff like that. So... So, I mean, she's doing a lot better, yeah. so. How did you know when to come out to your parents and how did you bring it up in a conversation? I didn't come out to my parents. I didn't come out to my parents either. My mom asked me, like, before, like, anything, like, I obviously came out as gay. Mm-hmm. And she actually was like, she brought it up to me, like, are you gay? Like, do you like girls? My mom asked me if I was gay too. And then, then I was like freaking out. I was nervous about it. But other than that, like I've never like told, like called somebody like, hey, really? Like I never, yeah. cause I've, I was always nervous about how somebody would react to me. But you said I'm trans. To my mom? Yeah. Well, yeah, but like, it's because like, we had the talk yeah. of like that and like out of anybody like parent wise or adult wise i'm most comfortable with her mm. and still like i just don't say anything to really anybody I'm, I'm very inverted yeah but when you put me in like a public situation i will talk but like usually like i'm just to myself and that's about it but yeah what happened with you obviously sod's coming out was a lot of bigger than mine no everybody like. coming out is just big on its own I know, so. but I mean, like, I, like, you had to twice, is what yeah. I mean. <laughs> so, for me, when I started talking to Saad, I don't think I've ever talked about this before. When I started talking to Saad, Saad still identified as a female. So, my mom and dad, oh my god, this was the most awkward thing. They sat me down in their bedroom and they looked at me and they were like, honey, are you gay? And I was like, what? I was like, what? I was like, what are you and talking it's like, about? 
I at the time was like getting ready to like tell Julia like I don't identify with and I already female. I already felt that energy off of you because yeah. we were never like I don't know you never had like that feminine energy towards me so anyway I'm like what no like I'm not I'm not gay like I don't know what I am but I'm not gay like I, I don't know what to tell you guys and then over time when I realized like my identity is pansexual it's funny my mom told me on the phone I never said it to her she just follows me on social media <laughs> so she was like yeah I've been doing research like seeing what pansexual is and like I just support you guys I mean she already supported us but yeah. it's like that's when she found out like my quote-unquote label yeah. was when the internet did so everyone always asks when are you getting married yo why is that such a thing <laughs> Huh? Really? I know it's been almost how many years now? This is crazy. Five years. Dating. Five? Yeah. It's oh gonna be gosh. going on six. That's crazy. For me and Saad, like personally, like I will speak, like we just don't have a pressure on engagement. We don't have a pressure to rush I, on like, marriage. Like it's not like, okay, like I, I don't know about you, but like I know a lot of girls or guys as well, they fantasize about getting proposed. I don't, I don't care. I don't. I'm sorry, like I, I want to marry you one day, yes, but like growing up, like I didn't have parents that were like married so it's like i don't see why it's a big deal like we already live like we're married yes we already have like literally kids and a, a house, house car like shared bank account everything we like live so like it's like married. i already live that way it's just like all that's gonna be is a certificate yeah which i get to people it's like a big deal but mm -hmm. to me and sod it's just i'm just like we're already like yeah already. i don't i'm not rushing and like if you wanted to like obviously like i'm gonna do that for you yeah it's, i'm not holding back for any like I'm crazy chilling. reasons it's just i just haven't yet it's just it's I'm getting sorry, a like, ring and then engaging and then planning a wedding I'm like oh my god and like who are we inviting fun and what are we doing whatever. where are we going it's just a lot you know? it's a lot so maybe one day but not anytime okay soon. so i know a question is going to be this hmm. babies oh uh, yeah it's, it goes wedding wait that was wait that was my next yeah, when's the wedding? <laughs> yeah, that was my next question. So people want to know if we have any updates on our baby plans because obviously we made a whole video talking about the process of like freezing Saad's eggs, if we're going to freeze mine, if we're going to use a surrogate, if I'm going to carry the baby. And I've always been, I'm not baking, no baby in my we were oven. We was like, mm -mm, babies. I was really? like, I'm not carrying a baby. Right. Like, I'm going to get a surrogate. But Recently. everybody, don't. Everybody, everybody uh, makes don't mistakes. Spend, don't spit your drinks out believe it or not i made a decision we made a decision don't cry i'm not You're i just tear up. up i don't mean to i don't mean to me and sad have actually talked about babies a lot recently yeah and we actually came to the decision well i guess it, like, it's me it's, it's my body decision, yeah. i came to the decision i literally called my mom and i asked her what it was like being pregnant <laughs> But I came to the decision that I do want to carry our children. I, I figured that it's already hard enough that we can't have a baby quote unquote naturally. So I feel like at least carrying it will make it feel more. We don't really, we talk to ourselves. About I don't know. It. We don't talk to really yeah, anybody we else. Do. About but anyway, it. I never thought I'd be pregnant ever. I mean you're ever. not right now. No, but just like it's knowing like that like started. I finally like I came to the decision that like I hopefully will be pregnant one day. So when do you think? In the the next couple years. Couple years. Yeah. Like when though? <laughs> this is the thing. <laughs> this man wants to have a baby. Like that's no, what he wants. No, I said he, listen, I said by the next he, I said listen, in two years. He doesn't, he doesn't care about marriage, right? But he wants a baby. Because he I just don't want to be baby. I don't want to be like really, really, really old by the time like I'm about to be twenty five. I'm about to be You 25. want a baby now. I'm not saying right now, no. Yes, no, you no, do. no. I wanna do some traveling he alone. Does. I want to do some traveling and stuff like that. You've literally been like, we would have a baby by now. That- Yo! Yo! This is gonna have the whole Cut kid! the camera! I'm the Cut one that's the like, no, I'm not ready yet. But, as far as like, what we've done going towards <laughs> that is absolutely nothing. I'm gonna be honest, because of Vlogmas, we have been like, so like, I keep saying drained. we need to call every day. It's just, it it's happen. very, for me as a trans man, it's a very touchy subject, uncomfortable, very just, it brings dysphoria out in like so many ways if you know you know if you understand you understand honestly like 
after vlogmas we really are gonna start like i mean a baby is a serious topic always but we are going to be taking it a lot more serious and trying to figure out the next steps in order to do the egg process and then start tea because that's what i'm really ready to do too like i know that's a question when is sod going on tea and it's after we figure out all this baby stuff because i want at least just to store one even if we don't you know what i mean even if we don't use it sorry i'm triggered by the question i just read that's why i'm over here like now if one more person asks what how do we have y'all are crazy you know how do you imagination do? how do you listen you could easily easily google something <laughs> you can easily like I, and it's weird because i feel like you know like a lot of people want to know which is like not weird at the same time but it's like i personally wouldn't ask somebody about I don't what's going on what i don't want to know doing. what i don't know and i don't care and you know what i mean yeah Gooby's here now, everything's okay. Yeah, he was crawling up in the back. I don't know if anybody noticed him. So somebody said, how are you guys doing? Just in general, how are you doing? I would just say we're pretty busy. Yeah. I mean, you've been like more like I've been super, tired, super exhausted. Vlogmas is fun, but it is so exhausting mm -hmm. at the same time. I feel like I just don't have enough time in the day to do things. Everything you want to do. And then by the time we're done filming, I'm so tired. Like mm -hmm. I barely Really have energy to work out but I need to work out or like I didn't eat breakfast till like four o'clock today which like is not okay and but... the kitchen was a mess so I terrible. just need to like make sure I eat on time yeah. and I, I'm just tired but besides that like I'm okay after vlog just tired too yeah pigs over here snoring too you need to post on the podcast oh my god we did one podcast episode a lot of people all. enjoyed it though it was really fun it's just like we don't have the set up. I know it's sad. I know it was a good I, time. Though. I wanna, I wanna like set something up though. If you guys like enjoy the podcast, let us know. Like if you guys really want the podcast, say we want the podcast back, and I'll figure something out. Like I'll have to like build a desk. I still want to do ASMR with pig and pie. I've been wanting to do that. Oh my god, I saw a comment and it was like Julia talks about ASMR in every video. Somebody said, "Why did you marry a girl?" Who? I don't know. Did you marry someone or did I? What are you talking about? I didn't marry anybody. Uh, that's what somebody said. <laughs> Ever want to design your own house? Yes. Yeah. Our next house. Yeah. Our, our next, our dream dream house. Yeah. It'll be like our forever home. Yeah. Basically. Exactly. That's what we're hoping for. But we do love this house right now. And like, we don't plan on moving anytime soon. Yeah. We don't, we don't plan on moving. Yeah. One thing that turns you on. Do you want to answer? <laughs> When you're very like caring and you compliment the me and when you let me sleep and when you're like, oh no, babe, it's okay. I'll go get you a pink you drink. On. Yes. It doesn't have pink to be drinks, sexual. Of course they turn No, you it's the way you are. Of course they it's turn It's the you way on. you are. It was so sexy. You let me sleep in today. I'll <laughs> tell you that much. It was very sexy. Okay. Somebody said- What about you? You didn't answer. Oh. Uh, when I suck your toe. Whoa. Okay. That does <laughs> that not, does not happen. happen. I'm kidding. They were like, I knew you guys did crazy stuff. No. 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 I don't know. Just like you in general. <laughs> uh, but do you plan on getting another pet if Julia would let me? Yes. Listen, look at this man we got right here. And that girl we got right there. They can't oh, she's see him. Shh. She's <laughs> gagged in her sleep. I don't know if you guys heard that. She <laughs> gagged in her sleep. <laughs> what is she I've never seen her do that before. She was like gonna throw up. <laughs> in our forever home, either I want like a sick, like, jellyfish tank or shark tank because i haven't seen a lot of jellyfish on my tiktok i just page. want like a shower for the dogs a future pet not a shower for the dogs it was oh. a future <laughs> well you were talking about what we wanted in the future house so no as a pet a shark is a pet babe okay <laughs> you said a shower is a pet next are you gonna finish your movie thing yo what movie thing the movie we filmed. It was finished. Do they no. mean like, are we gonna make they a second? They want a part two. Oh, Listen, we we what I to get the gang back together. What I really think, I think we should like do a part two. Like we should like rent out a place. Like, yeah, actually, I think, I think it like, could be good. It I could think be fire. I really think it could too. 
Okay, we were talking about this earlier. What is your new year resolution? Okay, and this is the thing. I don't believe in like waiting till January 1st to start something. Like right. when I want to start something, I start it. I do not wait. So like right. I have a step goal that I didn't have a couple months ago. So I mean, just thinking of the new year, I just want to continue to grow. I want to continue to work on my health physically, mentally, emotionally. 100%. I want to have a good mindset and I just want our business to continue to grow. That's good. Yeah. Same, basically same for me, but we're starting that now. Yes. But that is like our goal going into the new year, 100%. Yes. Do you love your boyfriend? Of course I do. I love him very much. Favorite thing to do together? Ooh, cuddle and watch anime. What is your favorite memory? Is this together? just a Q&A for me? You're What's just... your favorite memory together? We have so many memories, how am I supposed to pick? Does Antonio have a girlfriend? Yeah, we literally just made like basically a mini series on I it. I know. <laughs> we filmed two whole videos about it and we did a Q&A with him and her if you want to check it out. But anyway, <laughs> um, I hope we answered your guys' questions. Hope you got the tea we're looking for. I'm sorry we will not tell you how we have baby. Uh, how, we, how we do stuff. Yeah, anyway, <laughs> there's a cute puppy. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe for more. And we are going to end this video with a post notification shout out of the day. All right, guys, today's post notification shout out goes to Courtney. Courtney said, I've been subscribed for a while now. I turn on my post notifications. Love you guys. Love you too, Courtney. Thank you so much. If you guys want to be our next post notification shout out, all you have to do is subscribe, turn on that post notification, and comment below that you did so. It's that simple. With that being said, we, we love, love you guys. guys. We will see you later and stay A1.